let's see what we can do. Hey, what's up guys? Hey, Lincoln here, back with another video. I mean, it's been a while since you've seen my face because I've been uploading various old videos on myself. But today, I have a special video. Today, we'll be going through Cotton On's Michael Jackson merch. Now, you've probably seen me. I'm a Michael Jackson fan. Yes, I am a Michael Jackson fan for 10 years. And when I finally learned that Cotton On was actually doing official Michael Jackson merch, you know your boy's got to cop it. Now, I've got various garments down here that I would love to show you. So, let's start off with the first item. So, our first item is this denim jacket. Now, you're probably thinking that this is just your average Joe denim jacket, black denim jacket, but on the back, it's pretty cool. It's got the Michael Jackson Dangerous album art. Now, this is a great winter jacket. I love wearing it around campus, and it's pretty cool. It looks casual, looks very nice. Quite casual and I really love the styling of it. Uh, I get a lot of compliments about the uh, back cover especially. Um, yeah, it's pretty cool. I like it. Now, moving on to the next item. Now the next item we've got is this shirt, the Michael Jackson Bad shirt. It's got the Bad album cover with rainbow lettering on the side. But, I mean it looks pretty average but on the back I really like this. It is the Michael Jackson Bad Tour 88 and all the cities and states that he toured in. Especially, you got this little map detailing, got the toast stand well, looks pretty cool, looks very vintage. I haven't worn this yet in public, but uh, we'll soon see. All right, to the next garment. So the next garment that I've got is the world's biggest selling album of all time cover. It is Michael Jackson's Thriller. Does not have any back printing, but the thing I love about the most is the gold lettering. It's got the signature, got his face, and he's got the whole shebang, the whole Thriller album. Let's move on to the next garment. Now, the next garment is a bit simple. It is the Bad Tour 88 shirt. Now, it's simple, plain. It doesn't scream out too much MJ. But on the back, it's kind of the same logo, the Bad Tour, actually. It is the same logo, but this one, I like it much more better than the small one. Uh, this one, I like wearing it. Actually, this is probably my most worn MJ shirt that I have. It doesn't scream Michael Jackson fan per se, but if you know it, it's a pretty good wink and a homage to it. All right, to the next garment. Alright, so um, the next t-shirt that I've got, actually, they sold a similar design to it in a street streetwear store called Culture Kings. Um, they were selling that exact same garment for 50 bucks, but I got this one for 2 for 30. So looking at this one, it's pretty cool. The lettering, the signature, Michael Jackson with him holding a fedora hat. Looks like it's from the 80s, judging by his appearance, and probably it's a still from Billie Jean from um, the promotional pictures. No lettering at the back, no design. Looks pretty cool. It will look nice with a black casual jacket. All right, the next garment. Now, I think this is one of my, f actually they're all my favorites, but this one is particularly my favorite because it's my favorite song. It is Smooth Criminal and the Iconic Lean. Now it's got a cool font on the top and the bottom, Michael Jackson, of course. Smooth Criminal, and it's just a nice tee to be honest. Looks great, even when it's um, with a jacket, it just shows him leaning, it's awesome. All right, the next. All right, let's get on to the next garment. I think last but not least now, we've got a winter garment specifically. And um, similar to the denim jacket that we've seen first, it is dangerous cover skibby thing. Yeah. Um, looking at this one though, um, the picture of it seems kind of oversaturated. I think this is just a, a fault in one of the garments because I actually went to another cotton on and um, it wasn't as saturated. But at the back design, it has different dates and the countries. We've got MJ, King of Pop, Dangerous World Tour, 92 to 1993. And you've got all the countries. But the thing I have with this is not all countries are listed. Even if you just look at it right now, 
Bucharest isn't mentioned and you know Bucharest is the most it's the most overread concert even though it was the first dangerous tour to be on DVD and I think ever released it's overrated in my opinion all right that's next garment actually I think that's all the garments that I have thank you all for watching my jackets and t-shirts hope you enjoy like and subscribe and hopefully as per mentioned I'll do a closet tour of all my MJ jackets all my shirts and the things that I perform with catch you in the next video